Good morning, everyone. Welcome to my channel. My name is Brenda, and I am from Be Crafty 12. Uh, I've been making videos on here for a little while. Um, I actually had a YouTube channel prior, um, but uh, couldn't figure out how to get back in it because I deleted my old email account. And uh, so I started up the Be Crafty 12 site and started working with that. I started doing tutorials again. Um, April's been a hectic month. Uh, thank God it's over. I did, um, cards. I did a scrap the world, um, challenge for April. Um, I was in a number of swaps, uh, through my group on Facebook, not my group, but a group I belong to on Facebook, uh, actually two different ones. And so, uh, I really enjoyed the whole, uh, dealing with everything, but it was a lot of work and I also had some orders that I had to get ready for upcoming craft shows. Uh, we have, uh, one coming up this coming up weekend and, um, and then we had one just, uh, um, not last weekend, but the weekend before. So, uh, what I'm going to do today is my birthday is actually in a few days. It's May 5th. And, um, so I've never actually thought about it before today. Um, but, uh, Saturday when I went to the mail, I actually received two cards from one of my scrapbook groups and I, it just made me so happy. Um, I couldn't believe that two people I didn't even know personally had sent me cards and they took time to make me a card and it just, it meant the world to me. I don't usually ask for anything for my birthday. Um, I'm happy and, and feel blessed just to have another day. So um, what I actually thought of doing was asking everyone that if they would like to send me happy mail um, anytime in the month of May, uh, has to be postmarked by the last day of May, um, but if you will send me something, anything that you would like to send me, for happy mail. Um, it could be a homemade card. It could be, uh, well wishes. It could be a pack of stickers. It could be a little plaque, uh, pack of bling or a little bit of lace or anything like that. If you would send me any sort of happy mail whatsoever and, um, you have it postmarked by the end of May, the last day of May, then I will um, enter your name into a drawing to win some prizes. I will show you what the prizes are in just a minute, but that is my this month challenge is if you would be so kind to send me happy mail for my birthday anytime during May, I am going to put your name into a drawing and hopefully somebody will win something and that they enjoy. This is my address for those of you who would like to send me happy mail. Like I said, it could be just a card that says happy birthday on it. Um, I, I would appreciate it. It would be, it would mean the world to me to actually get something personal from someone else. And, um, it just made me so happy to, <laughs> to have the two cards that I got in the mail because I don't usually receive personal anything anymore. Um, it's usually bills or it's usually stuff that I've ordered on Amazon or from somebody's Zibit, uh, Zibit uh, account or Etsy or something like that. And I, I try to help other crafters out as much as I can. So I started doing um, Crafty Lori's um, um, thing where she's got a, uh, a Wish Monday. And I started going onto her channel and on Mondays she posts a thing where you can actually go and fulfill other people's wishes. So I started doing that because I just thought it would be the coolest thing in the world. If I have something that I can give to somebody else and it would fulfill their wish, it would feel so good for me to be able to do that for somebody else. I know some people can't afford uh, certain dyes and they, they may only need it for one project so they don't really want to spend the 20 or $30 for one single thing when they're not sure if they're going to use it for you know a long time. Um, I see, you know, hey, can I get a couple of die cut this or whatever the case may be. 
So like I said, um, that's my challenge for this month. And I'm going to set this aside because this is what you're looking at to win. I've got a brand new color block 12 by 12 scrapbook album. I bought this um, thinking that I was going to use it for scrapbooking. And then I was going to alter it and decided that it it's it's a rather nice album and I would like it to go to somebody that would actually be able to use it as a scrapbook album. I've seen many a different things done with them. Uh, so I'm looking forward to hopefully seeing somebody do something awesome with it. I have like 12 different large scrapbook albums and I deal with minis a lot. Um, so that's going to be one of the prizes that you're going to win. Um, I also have this brand new set of perfect pairing uh, stamp sets from Stampin' Up. And I included this one because it's got a lot of like happy things for happy birthday and thank you so much, which I don't think is ever said enough. Um, I think people need to send more thank you notes. Um, and if you include your address in your whatever you send me, I will send you a thank you note for sending me something. Even if you don't win, I'm going to send you a thank you note to thank you for participating and being part of my YouTube channel. Um, so I'm going to send that to you as well. Um, the person will also win. I've been giving these away. They are so lovely. I, I have them at my desk for crafting and it's just a little notepad. comes with quite a, quite a number of uh, pages in there, 75. And I love the fact that you can just hang it on something above on your, your desk. So it's not actually just sitting on your desk, but you can just hang it on like a shelf and then just grab a, a note off of there anytime you want. A lot of times I pick up my post-it notes and they end up everywhere, but where I need them to be. So where this can just hang right by my desk, it is like the best thing in the world. Um, I also have a pack of um, Baker's Twine from Stampin' Up. And this one is the Tangerine Tango. I love this. We've gotten several uh, packs of them. This is a brand new pack, not been used. Um, so you will get this as well. Um, I've also included a um, set of washi tapes, brand new in the plastic still. And I will be sending this to someone as well. And um, I've also created a mini album from My Sister Scrapper. Uh, she does the paper bag minis. And so I've created this paper bag mini. And I used one of my favorite Victorian type papers in it. it I loved the way it turned out. Um, it is an unfinished. Uh, meaning it's not embellished, but it is a fully completed album with tags that come out of the top. I just shoved that one down. <laughs> but it has tags that come out of the top, and each page folds open like this, and then the back flips, and then you have a spot there as well. So I love the papers. But unfortunately, I've been working so hard on getting everything done for the craft shows and such. I have not had the chance to alter it or <clears throat> um, decorate it, embellish it. And I know somebody would do an amazing job of embellishing it. So um, I, I love this album and I'd love to gift it to somebody that would love to have it as well. So if, um, if you'd like to participate, there you go. Um, I thank you so much for watching my video, taking part in my day. Um, I feel blessed by having the subscribers I do. I want more subscribers. So if you, uh, if you could share my video, I would appreciate it. Um, I would love to have many, many, many people subscribe and find uh, something crafty to do with me. So thank you. Take care and God bless. Bye-bye.